Hey guys, welcome to another episode of the Budget 4x4 Life. As you can see, we're at Bribie Island National Park today. We're going on the beach. That's right, we're going on the beach for the first time on the channel. So let's get straight into it. Hey guys, we are now on the inland track. Woo! We had a bit of rain last night, so the sand is nice and hard, so it's nothing difficult today. Um, but yeah, so far it's beautiful out here. Um, here's some pics. Also guys, another thing to know is um, how much the permit costs because you obviously need a permit to go on the beach. I think I paid $150 for an annual pass or it's $50 to go for a week. Alright guys, so this is the beautiful Bribie Island, there's a stack of things to do over here. So as you can see behind me is the beautiful ocean where you can swim in. There's a nice lagoon over here where you can put your kayak on. Heaps of water over here to play around with. And so on the island itself, there are a few amenities available um, with restaurants where you can sit down have a feast. There's also designated areas where you can let your pets go wild and um, where you can swim as well where lifeguards are available. But here where I stand, um, there's no toilets on this section, but if you go on the inland track, there are toilets over there with a few areas where you can have a picnic as well. I would definitely recommend coming on a weekday where there's no one around. As you can see, it's a Thursday today and we are literally the only ones on here. Weekends are stacked, so definitely make sure to pick the time right. And also make sure to have a look on the website uh, or on the internet about the tide so you don't hit the beach when it's high tide because then you get really soft sand. Um, but yeah, would I recommend this place? Absolutely, it's beautiful. It's up here in Queensland, if you're not sure, definitely bring the family and you'll have a great time. Did you have a good trip? 
Oh, it was awesome, eh? Hey? Karabi Island, I definitely recommend it. Um, show the people how good this looks. The sand is definitely very soft. Yeah, so at the moment it's high tide, um, so we need to push up the beach a bit more. Um, so definitely make sure you're prepared in case you get stuck, like having Max tracks or a buddy that joins you. As well um, as some food or water, just in case. Yeah, you know, <laughs> for the girl, you know, you can bring her along, definitely food and water, otherwise she's going to be grumpy. Um, but yeah, <laughs> otherwise, just send it, eh? Hey guys, we are just on our way back and I'm just showing you there is a servo available to pump up your tyres. So don't stress out too much if you don't bring your air compressor. It's say about two kilometres from the beach. So yeah. As soon as you get off Gribe, you just continue straight on and then you get to this car wash over here. So if you're just going to do an underbody wash now, I think it's about $15, so definitely worth it, especially if you've been driving on the beach. So that is us for today. Thank you so much for joining in and um, we'll see you next time.